Experiment number 33. Experimental study of the characteristics of a dynamic equilibrium system using ferrous and thiocyanate system. Aims of this experiment are to develop a better understanding of a dynamic chemical equilibrium and to investigate the effect of the application of some stress on the equilibrium portion of an equilibrium system. Chemicals required for this experiment are 0.05 ampheric nitrate solution, 0.05 m potassium thiocyanate solution, 1 m sodium hydroxide solution, and distilled water. Equipments required are beakers, measuring cylinders, eyedropper pipettes, and test tubes. Now let's see how the experiment is done. First put 2 ml of ferric nitrate solution into a test tube. Since this is a qualitative experiment, volumes can be measured using a measuring cylinder. Now let's add 2 ml of potassium thiocyanate to the same test tube. Now let's dilute this blood red solution until it becomes pale orange color using distilled water. This is the pale orange solution we got after diluting. Now let's divide this solution into four parts including the control test. These are the prepared test tubes. To the second test tube add 10 drops of sodium hydroxide. Compared to the control test, second test tube has turned into a pale solution and brown color precipitate can be observed. To the third test tube, add 10 drops of ferric nitrate solution. Compared to the control, third test tube turned into a blood red solution. To the final test tube, add 10 drops of potassium thiocyanate solution. Compared to the control, fourth test tube also turned into a red color solution. Observation and conclusions we obtained from this experiment are included in this table. 